My name is Russell Berman. I'm the editor of the journal Telos, a quarterly dedicated to the critique of the contemporary. Our new issue, Telos 168, is dedicated to the topic of the West, its past and its prospects. This is a timely topic indeed. The West, the alliance of liberal democracies around the world, faces numerous challenges, from Islamist extremism with ISIS, from an aggressive Russia under Putin, and from the ambitions of China in East Asia. How the West is responding, how Washington has been responding, these are topics of great concern. In this issue, we take a historical perspective. Indeed, the first two articles are written by distinguished historians. The issue begins with a piece by Jeffrey Herf, who points out how many different traditions have in fact made up the West in the past. Some of these traditions have pointed toward liberal democratic arrangements, but others have been much more nefarious. We shouldn't delude ourselves by forgetting that fascism and communism both emerged from within the West. But he argues as well that the West and its optimistic ambitions are indispensable to the future of humanity and therefore hopes that Washington leading the West will, will respond to its challenges robustly. In contrast, Michael Kimmage sees the notion of the West as merely historical. That is to say, it rose in an era when the U.S. Uh, role in the world was, was growing increasingly after the conclusion of the First World War, but has come to an end in the post-Vietnam era. For him, the West rose, fell, and is over, and has no relevance to contemporary politics as well. That conflict between Herf and Kimmage underscores many of the other articles that look at the deeper historical legacy of the West, its origins in Christianity, uh, and its prospects for the future. Take a look at this issue. When you've read it, I'd be happy to hear from you and learn about your responses.